Hi, welcome to Mathematics Heuristic and Mavis. The next type of question we'll be looking at is working backwards. Usually, this kind of question will be given two or more quantities where there are changes made to them. Then, we are given the final range proportion and we need to find the initial conditions. Now, let's take a look at the working backwards question. So we will start with the n ratio. We were told that in the end, the number of suites that Mindy had to the number of suites that Lisa had became 2 is to 3. So that means Mindy will have 2 units and Lisa would have 3. Now we need to reverse the actions accordingly. In the last action, Mindy gave 3 7 of her suites to Lisa. That means Mindy would have left 4 7 of her suites. So we have to make the lowest common multiple of 4 for Mindy. So we multiply by 2 to make Mindy 4 units. Then Mindy would take back her 4 7 of her suites from Lisa, which is 3 units. So the ratio of Mindy to Lisa would then be 7 is to 3. The previous action says that Lisa gave one third of her sweets to Mindy. That means Lisa would have left two thirds of her sweets. So we have to make use of lowest common multiple again to make Lisa to have six units. So we multiply by two to make Lisa six units. So now Lisa will take back her one third, which is three units, from Mindy. Which gives us the initial ratio of 11 is to 9. We were told that Lisa have 70 suites less than Mindy at first, which is two units. So one unit would then be 35 suites. So let's answer the question. Question asks, how many suites did Lisa have at first? So looking at the initial ratio of 9 units, Lisa would then have 315 suites.